the development never stops. We are always on the way. Everything we do has influence. We search for better quality, for an idea, and the idea is over there, and then we go forward. Tain is the world of instrument making in a very special way of sound designing. We are a company who wants to create the sound the musician wants to hear on his instrument. I'm a trombone player and my brother uh, Heinrich, he founded the company with me together. He was trumpet player. So this was our main goal, also what we had in our eyes. After retiring of my brother, Olaf Brandt, become my partner in the company. And so we do the same. And this is a very good thing for me and for also the customers that we work in the same way like sippers together. And we also have different views to the same point. So we can discuss these things and can always bring instruments to a higher level. I feel really welcome here as a person, as a musician. Um, I feel respected and I feel that they want to make me help to get better. And it's a very vibrant atmosphere. If you go through the uh, hall where they're building the instruments, I really like it. I like the atmosphere, I like the sounds, I like somehow the silence, how they work, but still there's, there's movement, you can feel that they're really building something. I really like the atmosphere. My experience with uh, Tyne trumpets is that they have a very big sound which could reach the audience very far away. Yeah? And sometimes you have instruments which are very easy to play but you cannot hear uh, 100 meters far away. So uh, I think the experience to play Tyne trumpets is that we could do everything you want. Yeah? When you start to build it by hand, you always uh, notice how you work, so you control it by your own. My meaning is you have to thinking like metal. Something when you uh, work with wood, wood, everybody uh, says wood lives. But metal lives too, but not in, a, in so, such a big way like wood. But you can feel it if it's too strong or it is not, when you bend it, you have can do it fast or I can do it slow. You, you can feel it by hand. That is our thinking of making instruments, that we have a really good quality and every instrument is a little bit different between because uh, you are building by hand and every instrument has a super top quality, top intonation 
And uh, with this, we do all things. And the best thing of our meaning is to do it by hand. In general, it's something like when you cook a soup and you put sausage and beans in and you taste it. When you are hungry, you will eat it, but you miss a lot. And then you start as a good cook. You put some spices in, salt, not much, only like this. And then you taste again and then you find out, wow, this is a big changing. Close to nothing in, but the taste is so much nicer. We have a cast style metal. Max and Heinrich melted 30, 35 years ago. You have different mixtures between the materials. So there are some, you say today, it were dirty things inside. Because today all materials are so even, so clear. The yellow brass with copper and zinc is really without any percent of uh, different things like uh, ferro, like mangan, like chrome or nickel inside. But uh, in the past you have material who is more lively, you make more overtones and so on. And at this moment Max and Heinrich decided to have the uh, same material with many dirty things inside, but the dirty things make a special sound. The unique thing about Tyne trumpet sound, it's a brilliant sound but a warm sound which touches me from the very first note I play on it. There is a lot of soul in this sound. I think it has to do a lot with the love and passion, how they work and how they build the instruments. I think they do their job like I do it as a musician also. They have a passion for it and they have fun to build these instruments. I have fun to play music and to play on these instruments. So it's the same approach. It's the love for music, it's the love for sound, it's the passion for getting better. And I think they give it also when they build the instruments. What I really like is I always think about new things and he's open to it and he's not annoyed. It might be just a small adjustment, like a new lead pipe, a new mouthpiece, some, something you can put on the instrument, something to take away, like weight and stuff. I really hope it's not the end of the, the journey, just like, oh, take this and play on it for 30 years. I just, I like it too much to experiment, uh, so I hope we can continue this. <laughs> For me it's a fantastic situation because we try to make the instruments more comfortable for the players uh, to um, find out which is the best way to make it easier, to have a bigger sound um, and it's a little bit like a tailor. If the tailor knows you very well, uh, he knows what you like. That's the, the same. If you have a, a trumpet maker like Max, uh, who knows very well my taste of sound, uh, what I need uh, for special music, for special pieces. It's fantastic to have a very good instrument which fits perfect on, on your uh, way of playing. We developed together this Berlin model. I went there actually every week for two to three days and I got to know this working process and developing process even more. I talked to Max and I said to him, I would like to have an instrument which is with not so much weight, which feels easy, in also if you hold it, which plays easy, which sounds big and which where you can um, make as much colors 
and different expressions as possible. So beside our instrument making for trumpets, trombones mainly, we do something for the local people. We like music. We love music and we can see how people can grow up. It's a lot of fun to, to help amateurs, beginners. We are open for, for everyone. And for questions, for go forward, for interest. Yes, music is the nicest thing in the world. Everybody is welcome. Everybody. So starting up children, we always uh, uh, are together with schools and music schools for instruments for starting because when you start with instruments you has to be a good instrument and when you have a good instrument to start you can be a good musician later you have fun at the music from the start and when you have no fun at the beginning and the instrument works not for you you don't want to learn it people make an appointment with us and they can come like 10 kilometers from here, but also like 6,000 or 10,000 kilometers. When we meet, we don't want to have something like an audition. We want to have something like a home atmosphere. So every time uh, I come here, for me it's like a little bit a Christmas and holiday. Yeah? Because if I come here, for me I have no really work. Yeah? So I come to the factory, uh, practice, test and try new instruments. And every time uh, it makes my playing easier and better. And that's a fantastic feeling for every player. Some customers come to us every two or three years to update their instruments because everything changed a little bit. The work, sometimes we change a little bit in the workshop so it will be the sound get better. Or the sound will be easier. Or the sound will get bigger. The customers and the musicians get older and we want to be at their side the whole life. At every part of a life we are on their side and when they have problems or ideas we want to solve that with them. We are at the side that you can be with your instrument the whole life. This is our thinking, to be a team, to be a family with a musician. Family has to do with the, the atmosphere people create around you and uh, it has to do with trust, it has to do with reliability. It's a kind of an exchange. It's not that somebody gives you an instrument and says like, okay, take this, this is the best we have. And if you can't play on this, it's your fault. It's just the other way around. It's like they're very open to your ideas and they're very open. And it's like, I feel very free to say what my needs as a musician are. And then you gain trust in people. I personally don't feel that I'm client number one million. It's like when you come and you say, I have this need, I have this problem, um, this doesn't work for me, do you have an idea? It very rarely happens that he says no. It's more like, okay, give me a minute, I have to think about it. And then you find a way, it's experimenting, it's like working together, basically. For the next 50 years, I wish that the people respect and love what we do. That's the most biggest wish for the future. That they understand, yeah, we want to support them. <laughs> it's not easy to, it's not easy. Good. It's not easy to, to sometimes bring it so on the point. Most people want to give it me one sense. Huh? So we want to say, we want to be the number one in the world or whatever. Yeah. But this is something. No, no. But 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 it, it's too too. Yeah. Too much business like. Yeah. Not like we are. We are different in, in our way.